<sighs> the card fight club's getting there. We're up to four members now. Just one more, and we'll finally have our official club status from the school. That's nice. Listen, we're heading over to Card Capital now. You want to join us? Sorry. Akari and I have already made plans, so thanks, but we'll pass. Huh? That's too bad. Are you sure? Bye. What plans do we have? Mm. Yes, you are the fun girl that show me the way Let it show me the gentility Some days I feel like Johnny That's Misaki Tokura, grade 11. She's not exactly the friendliest person in the class, but she still ends up with some of the best grades of any of us. The rumor I heard is she's got some serious power, and she's practically the boss of this school. <laughs> the way you talk, you make it sound like Misaki's head of the school mafia. Oh. You already know her. Are you gonna tell us how? She and I used to be kind of teammates. They were teammates? You looking at me? Get lost, punk! I get it. You joined the mob to get revenge for being teased. I'm in total shock. How could my idol have such a dark side? I think you've got the wrong idea. I only know Misaki because she works at the card shop I go to. One time, the shop held a tournament and we ended up on the same team. Really? Well, in that case, mm -hmm. she could be useful. Why don't you invite her to become a member, Aichi? I think she's too busy at the store, so she's not available. You sure of that? Did you actually invite her to join the club? Huh? You know what? I'm sure Misaki'd be happy to help you out. What? Won't you? Mm -hmm. I don't have time for extracurricular stuff. Someone's got to stay here and run the shop. Did you? Did you actually invite her to join the club? Well, no. Not exactly. Guess not. Honestly, no wonder she's acting so weird if you haven't even asked her. Hey, Misaki, did he say something to upset you? Not really. Then why are you giving him such attitude? It's like you've gone back to the old you. Hey, why do you always have to build a wall around yourself to hide behind? It's not healthy to keep doing that. 
Give it back. Give me back my mirror. What? You're such a liar. It's mine. Are you kidding? You're accusing her of being a thief? <laughs> yeah. Do you have any proof? Well, not really. I do. Huh? From my seat, I've got a good view of the whole classroom. I can see the clock and Akari's desk. At three different times, 9.33 a.m., 10.36 a.m., and 11.34 a.m., I saw you approach Akari's desk for no apparent reason. My guess is you were waiting for the perfect opportunity to steal the mirror that belongs to her. As if. Her mirror has a pattern of three roses and four smaller white flowers on the back side. Hmm. And there's a scratch on the rose at the bottom. Have <laughs> your stupid mirror. Not only are you a thief, but you've also got a bad temper. You're no good all around. You are tragic, 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 tragic. How did she remember all that stuff? She's a freak. I remember how people were initially surprised at your special gifts. But no one cares about that anymore. There's no need for you to build a wall between yourself and everyone else, pushing them away. I mean, look at your new hairstyle. Did you cut it just because you wanted a change, or for some other reason? Misaki! Huh? It's you. Hi, Chi. <sighs> Misaki, before, I wanted to ask you something, but I wasn't clear. When I first got the idea to start up a card fight club, I would always imagined that you would be a part of it, Misaki. So how about it? Would you consider joining us in the card fight club? Please, would you? What is with this guy? Sounds more like he's trying to ask her out on a date than join a club. Whoa! She's a superstar! She's shorter than I thought. A member of Ultra Rare here in my shop? <laughs> I can't believe my luck! It's Corin here in person! Just chill, Morikawa. Down, boy. <sighs> it looks like you really are a bit of a big deal then. You only just figured that out? Eh, you're nothing special. Uh -huh. Watch it, four eyes. Ah. Oh, you're just in time. Hey, look, Aichi's here. Are you okay? So, how did it go? With that gangsta gal. Did she become a member of the club? No, she declined. For now, anyway. At least I asked her face to face, which was a step forward. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> There's no need for you to apologize. Yeah, it's all cool. Maybe we can help you find some more members tomorrow. Mm. Interesting. Mm -hmm. So Misaki didn't want to sign up. Hope she didn't use the shop as an excuse. She really needs to get out and enjoy life a little bit more. Hold on. This Misaki, I heard that she works part-time here? Yes, that's right. When this shop first started up, it actually belonged to her parents. But not now. Unfortunately, they passed away when she was just a little girl. This shop is more than just a store for her. It's filled with lots of precious memories. Huh? Uh, Corin, you look like you're miles away. You got something on your mind? Huh? <laughs> I know what it is. I think she's fallen in love. What? You can't do that, Corin. Our ultra-rare contracts prohibit us from having any relationships. Right, Suiko? That's right. Don't be stupid. There's this person at the Academy who's got this pretty unusual gift. That's what I was thinking about. And what gift is that? Do they play Vanguard? They do. I just can't get them out of my mind. How intriguing. Huh? Master Takuto. I thought Miyagi Academy was a wasteland when it came to card fighting. It's great to hear that someone with ability has shown up. Maybe there's hope after all. Right, Corin? Hmm. Ugh, I've had it with you, Misaki. What's wrong? You, yesterday. I don't understand why you don't want to join their club. It's none of your business. Good morning. Uh -huh. hmm. Misaki Tokura? Whoa, that's Korin Tatsunagi. 
What do you want with me? Are you free? May I have a moment of your time? Huh? Misaki Topura, let me challenge you. Let's have a Vanguard card fight. What for? Why me? I heard when Aichi asked you to join the club that you turned him down. Are we not good enough? Or is there something else? This, this isn't just about Vanguard. Could it be they're rivals in a love triangle? Mm. Not a chance. These are the decks we lend out. You can take your pick. She uh, won't need to use those. You mm. see, she's got her very own deck right here in her bag. Hey, you, keep your hands off. Any spare minute she's got, Misaki's always tweaking. If she them. loves Vanguard Shut that up. much, then why isn't she interested? No, she declined. For now, anyway. Why would she make Aichi come and ask her in person? Stand up, Vanguard! First I'll ride, Lozenge Magus. And I will ride, Crimson Lion Cub Kier. or the power to blow past your enemies. Which will you choose to card fight with? Trial decks Misaki Tokura and Naoki Ishida. Available February 8th, Bushy Road. Buddy Fight Ace! Buddies that you have fought many battles with have come together once again to seek new fights. Buddy Lineage, now on sale! Bushy Road! Buddy Fight Ace! Let's become stronger, Garga. Wait, Cross and Ogito get new abilities too? I'll fight my opponents with all my power. True Awakening of Deities, now on sale. Bushy Road. Vi Schwartz, the characters from another world are here. Are you ready to restart your life in another world? Re, zero, starting life in another world. Trial Deck Plus and Booster Pack, now on sale. Bushy Road. She's using Oracle Think Tank, a clan that specializes in predicting the future. My turn next. I ride. Who are Megus? Fortune telling. I see it. I see your fate. <sighs> in addition, with the skill of Lozenge Megus, I draw one card and end my turn. Right from the start, she's manipulating the deck with a plan in mind. Can I ask you something? Go ahead. Is it true that you're the boss of this school because you have some sort of special power? Huh? <laughs> you? The boss? That is so ridiculous. However, she does have a superpower. Just shut up. So this superpower, is it something you use in your card fighting too? I've seen you playing Vanguard just once before. If you've assembled your deck the same way this time, your grade one units are... Waving Owl, Listener of Truth Dindrain, Evil Slaying Swordsman Haugen, and finally, Knight of Elegant Skills Gareth, four units. Ugh. How did you know? Once I've seen something, I never forget it. That's the skill I have that sets me apart from everyone else. I've heard of people who have a photographic memory. Your brain works as a camera taking pictures of everything you see. It's a very unusual gift to have. You're exaggerating. I just, I have a slightly better than average memory. Hmm. I attack the Vanguard. That's a no guard. However, I will admit that everyone seems to be daunted by this so-called gift of mine. As you can tell from all the rumors you've heard, <laughs> I wasn't built for this. I don't understand why they made me do this. Me and manual labor do not go together. Huh? Isn't that Corin? With the backstage boss? Now it's my turn. I'll bring out Rectangle Magus. Ride! Come, my avatar, and join me. Using the ability of Rectangle Magus? 
I look at two new cards. She's manipulating the deck again. When Aichi first started coming to the shop, he was a bit nervous and seemed out of place. However, as he got more experience with card fights against all sorts of opponents, his confidence grew. Deep down, I was amazed at how much he had changed. He was like a new man. And now, thanks to you, it looks like his confidence is growing even more. No one likes me here at the Academy. If I join your club, it would only cause problems, and I don't want to do that. No guard. This is the path I've chosen, and I'm sticking to it. Critical trigger. Power to the rear guard Rectangle Magus, and critical to the vanguard. Also activate skill of Rectangle Magus. Get serious. Huh? You have excellent card fighting skills. So why are you being so weird towards Aichi? This card fight club is something Aichi wants to create together with you. What? This, this isn't good! I've decided. That's it. I'm gonna crush you with everything I've got. But if she loses, that means she won't be able to join the club. Maybe she wants to lose on purpose. She's right. So here's what we'll do. If I win, then you agree to join the club. If you don't want that, you'll have to try your best to defeat me. Hm. It's a deal. What? Are you sure? Corn and the backstage boss are having a card fight? Shh. We don't want everyone to know. Do you know why? Do I look like I know? Do you think she's trying out for the club? That's it. You're right. Shingo. Can you show me where they're playing? Yeah, sure. Don't go. Class is about to start. Wait a second. I don't even like this class. Oh. So who's winning? Looks like it's at three damage each. See that? Corin's already riding her blonde Ezel. She's also got her Axel Circle formation in place. Guess all her huh? special powers aren't gonna save her in this match. Misaki. Hmm. Huh? You're here. You come to watch this? Of course we did. We're your fellow club members, and we need to support you. Cheer you on. Fellow club members. She's a freak. How did she remember all that stuff? No. Don't talk to him. I just need to watch over him. Ride! Hexagonal Magus. Imaginary gift. Protect! With the skill of Hexagonal Magus, Look at two cards from the deck and draw. I call Rectangle Megas to the rear guard. Activate skill. Guided by the red string of fate, come my comrades! She's managed to line them up all at once. Looks good. I bet she's gonna try and finish things off now. Misaki. Rectangle Megas and Tetra Megas. Attack the vanguard! Help out! Dauntagol! Thanks for that, my Dauntagol. With a boost from Tetra Megas, Hexagonal Megas attack! That's no guard. The red string of fate has been spun. Twin drive! First check. <laughs> Critical trigger! Hall effects to the vanguard. Second check. She had that one up her sleeve. A damage check. Draw trigger. Power goes to Blonde Ezel. Now Corin's up to five damage. She's at her limit. Come on, Misaki. Are you ready to roll, big sister? I'm ready and raring to go.
Oh, no, you don't. This isn't over yet. Ah! She survived it. Way to go, Corin. You thought I'd give up? I can't afford to lose this match. Now it's my turn. Evil slaying swordsman Haugen and Halo Shield Mark. Did she just call a sentinel? This'll finish you off. Mimi and Lion, attack the vanguard! That's no guard. My damage check... No trigger. Gareth and Vivian, attack the vanguard! <laughs> Using a boost from Mark, the vanguard attacks! Next, I activate the skill of Blondezel. Superior call, Battlefield Storm, Sagram. Sagramore Soul Blast. I draw one card. Superior Call, Knight of Elegant Skills, Garrett. Misaki will be fine. She has her imaginary gift. Imaginary gift. It's Protect. Twin Drive. First check. Second check. Wow, that's great! A double trigger! So much for this so-called fate you've been spinning. It looks like it's come to an end. <laughs> and that's it. You've defeated me. Ah, oh, too bad, Aichi. Yeah, guess we gotta keep looking for members elsewhere. You know, maybe we should try again? Let's give Misaki a second chance to win? Wait, there's no need for that. What? But if you won the match, Corin, That means she fails the entrance test. She's out. Hmm. Idiots. Well, I guess that finally makes it official. I'm the club's newest member. Great! Welcome on board! Nice to have you with us. I'm sorry, Aichi. I'm really excited that we'll be spending some time together as club members. Thanks, Corin. This is because of you. Uh, please, it's fine. It's not like I was doing it for you or anything like that. Playing it cool? Yeah, right. What did you just say? <laughs> Nothing. I didn't mean anything by it. There's no so deal. now we have our Shut five club members. My dream is beginning to turn into a reality. Ready? Everyone say cheese. Oh! 
And that's five. We've even got the backstage boss. No one's gonna mess with us. Who are you calling a backstage boss? Uh, Misaki. This rumor that I'm the backstage boss of the school is a load of nonsense. What about when you broke up a whole gang in the field with clay pipes? Huh. That's the problem with amateurs like you. They weren't clay pipes, they were hume pipes made of iron reinforced concrete. Say what? The hume pipe was named after a civil engineer. We may be five very different people, but now we're a team and we hope you'll be cheering us on.